To balance this equation, BaNO32 plus H2SO4, let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. We have one barium, and then NO3, that's the nitrate ion. We have it here, and we have it over here. So when we have these double displacement reactions, it's often useful to count the polyatomic ions as just one item if they appear on both sides. So we have one NO3 times the two, that gives us two of the nitrate ions. Two hydrogens, and again, we have the sulfate ion, SO4. We have it here, and we have it here. So we have one SO4. On the product side, we have one Ba, one nitrate, one hydrogen, and then SO4, one sulfate. Let's balance the hydrogen here. That might fix the nitrates. If we put a two in front of the HNO3, the nitric acid, one times two, that balances the hydrogens. And the one nitrate times the two, that gives us two of those. And we're done. This equation is balanced. So you can see the utility of counting the nitrates is one thing if they appear on both sides, or the sulfates as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for barium nitrate plus sulfuric acid. Thanks for watching.